Hello the people of the universe, this is the Vivian Wizard and welcome back to another video. And today in this video, we are once again going to be playing Minecraft Communities as we so often are on this channel. And today we're going to be finishing off what we were building in the last video. And I suddenly had a thing where like I remembered like a couple of uh, well, a couple of months ago now I guess because I think I uploaded it in around March or maybe January even. Um where we were stood like in my old room down there and I said um we're going to be finishing off what we've been what we were building in the last video and I said like you can see it just loading in now and that was the clock tower that was so long ago and now like I've moved bedrooms I've got a proper balcony like I've got a proper routine going now and yeah so let's jump off the balcony as always and stick with the routine that I just mentioned um and also I have a thing so I realized that the florist is very very close to the um thing that we're building to the, the greenhouse place that doesn't really have a name um that's that's why I wanted to build it out of green stained glass because then it could be the greenhouse I could just call it that but I think I the thing I will call it that anyway but it's less of a pun in the name I guess uh, and you can see it just the um, the uh, like just sticking out across the pavement. Um, but yeah, I realised it's incredibly close and incredibly similar style of thing to that. And I did think maybe it'd be interesting to have like a secret tunnel linking them or something. But I'm not entirely sure what I think about that. But I think I am going to have some sort of like link between them somehow, somewhere. And I have just realised I don't have any Birchwood. That's like the only thing that that's like the main part of the floor. Well, it's not the main part of the floor. There is no real main part of the floor because it's being um, like built with the biome box thing. So in case you did miss the last episode, then what we're building is we're building um, and ooh, there's just a trident here. That's a tiny bit odd. Um, okay, I'm just gonna let that be. Um. But yeah, so, like, I'm building the equivalent. In the game Terraria, you've got, like, um, you. it's a common thing to build biome boxes, which is where, like, you have a box... It's just a box with a biome in it. Uh, but they have, like, different biomes in each box. We're doing a similar thing, but we're doing it in Minecraft. Um, it's going to be with all, like, the different types of plants in it. So we're going to be building a desert. We're going to be building the equivalent of a nether biome box going to be building a plains biome box and we're going to be building a jungle biome box so we're going to have some bamboo which I'm going to have to borrow from uh, Laurie's place because I couldn't find any more bamboo in the wild and I don't know where he got his from but it will grow back though um, I'm hoping uh, well yeah it will grow back because bamboo that's what bamboo tends to do bamboo tends to grow so yeah he shouldn't mind if I just borrow a tiny bit of his bamboo so, I, I said bamboo so much in that sentence. But yeah, let me go and quickly fill in this. So it's essentially just going to be a big cross in the middle of this. Um, made out of birch. And then um, in each quarter of the of the room split up with the cross is going to be a different biome. So I think it should be pretty cool. Uh, so let me go and quickly destroy that because that's not supposed to be there. Um, and then just carry on building along here. And oh yeah, I did build, I did finish off the roof in between this episode and the last. Um, so this is what I mean uh, in the combination of building styles. It's sort of got that for the main frame of it, but then up there, like it's got the thing where you do half slab block, half slab block to make it look like it's two half slabs with two different materials that don't necessarily have half slabs out of them. So yeah, I thought that was quite a cool um, uh, build for my roof on that place but uh, I'm not entirely sure like what you all think because obviously I haven't uploaded the video yet um, because I'm recording this pretty much straight after so let me go and quickly chop down another birch tree because I have run out of birch wood um, I, I don't know whose that trident is because not too many people come around here and no one's on the world currently I don't think so yeah I'm not entirely sure whose trident that is because it can't like just be there it's not just spawned in or anything 
So yeah, let me just go and make all the rest of this. 24, that should be more than enough, I hope. Um, if it isn't now, I'm going to look like a complete idiot. But like, I sort of look like that anyway. Um, but yeah, let me go and build, uh, well, dig across here, I guess. Uh, where is the middle on this side? This is the middle. It should be, so it's 11 blocks, so it should be five on each side of the middle. I'll just check that in a minute, but I'm pretty sure this is right. One, two, three, four. Oh, hang on. oh yeah, five, because this is here. So yeah, uh, it should be four by four. No, it's four by five. Um, well, okay, <laughs> I guess that's okay because it's just more room, I guess. There aren't really any specific layouts I've done for any of these. It's just sort of like trying to make it look a bit like a, it's like a cross section or like a chunk out of it. And I have only gone and done it. I've only gone and not chopped down enough wood, and there's only one block of wood. That's really annoying. Right, um, so obviously I'm gonna need to place like a floor below the floor for the sand, for the desert. Um, so I think I'll use jungle wood for that. Originally I was gonna use birch, but obviously you can't see it, so it doesn't really matter. But uh, yeah, jungle wood can do for that instead of um, having to chop down even more birch trees. Uh, I really should have chopped down these before because like I do need them. Um, and we are starting to build incredibly close to the community as well. Like, uh, I remember thinking, like, th th this so far, this episode has been me faffing around trying to do stuff and just reminiscing about old thoughts and things that I said, like, three months ago. Um, but yeah, I remember thinking at some point we'll get, um, to at the point where they're almost touching, and we're not there yet, but... It's a lot closer than I was expecting to be at this point. Um, so, yeah, I've made way too many because I chopped down way too much, but I'm not just going to leave a half um, thing there, uh, a floating tree even. I am going to chop down the entire thing. So let me go and let's do the desert one first because that's going to be the most complicated. Uh, only because you've got to add this floor underneath. But this seems to have worked out incredibly well with uh, underneath it being quite a high up ground uh, so it shouldn't take too long to have to um, try and fiddle about with this um, where is the thing there we go uh, so I just need to build it all on this level it doesn't really matter what it looks like but it does need to be able to have sand on top of it um, and then I can't quite reach that annoyingly and I still can't reach that, but what might be worth doing is just piling up uh, there and then I can just um, place the rest of it while I'm on this level. And oh, I did reach that bit, I didn't think I did. That's uh, worked out quite well then. Uh, but yeah, this is just an easier way of uh, doing it. Um, so I don't have to, uh, have to try and jump to try and put it there. So I might as well have just done that first, but hey, there we go. Uh, so then we're just going to add a bunch of these and it's going to have a bunch of cacti inside um, and we're going to have like a little hill over here it's not going to be a proper hill obviously because of how small it is but like I said I wanted it to sort of look like um, it just been taken out of a desert like a chunk out of a desert or I guess it would be a quarter of a chunk of a desert um, so yeah, that's actually, I think I'll just do the terrain on all of these first and then I'll go and uh, add the actual plants that are going to be growing. Um, so this one is going to be a nether biome box. Uh, so this is going to be the only one that I need to destroy all the floor for again. Uh, but I need to go and get some nether rack and this is going to be growing nether warts. Um, just because that is a thing that we need to grow. So I've got obviously soul sand. And I've got some uh, netherrack to grow the um, thingy mcbob on. And I've also got a bucket of lava for it. Um, so we will hopefully be able to um, make it look a bit like a lava lake. So if I go and break this down there, it can't be touching here. Otherwise that wood plus lava does not work um, very nicely. So if I go up like that, and then you can't really see through lava in the same way that you can water, so it doesn't really matter what's underneath here. But I might as well just carry on doing this netherrack because it's what I happen to have in my hand. But I have run out of netherrack, 
so dirt will have to do um, I'll just clog that up there like so and then I need to run outside and I have got some water as well like I said I would um, and just go and grab the lava uh, so oh I've done this stupidly oh yeah you can't make infinite lava sources can you that is very annoying right um, so I think what I'll do then is I'll go and add the soul sand in and then I'll add this along here and then I'll add the lava bucket there so that's just going to be a one block thing and then do I have I've got a flint and steel in the chest I believe uh, yes I do no more netherrack though either which is annoying because I was going to add a little bit of a hill to that as well um, oh wait no that's going to spread that is going to spread uh, that can go there then so yeah this is the nether biome box thing I like I don't know whether I'm, I'm going to end up calling these biome boxes like officially well it's not official but like officially in communities terms I guess um, because they're not like that's from a different game so I don't know I might end up calling these biome boxes I might not so oh wait hang on I've done this wrong haven't I over here needs to be sand as well so I need to dig away all of this but there is also going to be a water stream going through this one um, just to like break it up a little bit um, and the bamboo also looks quite nice growing next to it so it's going to be like a, it's a little beach I guess um, so I need to go along like this so I need let's just go and build it all up so it's solid ground underneath those because then I also need to put sand on um, the underneath the water because you can see through water you can't see through lava so what was underneath the lava wasn't too important I want to keep an eye on that lava to make sure that it hasn't spread otherwise it will burn the entire thing down and uh, it seems to be doing fine um, so let's me go and grab this sand here and then we're just going to go along like this and then we're just going to leave like a little gap for the stream in the middle uh, like so that seems to work quite well and then I do obviously need to break away this so much I use a shovel I do have a shovel on me so there's no reason really why not to uh, and then you just go and fill this in with sand and then I need to go and grab some more water buckets I don't really need to bother making an infinite water source for this uh, because it's not going to take too many I think this should probably be enough if I do it over there oh no it's not going to be enough I do need three by the looks of things hopefully I won't need all four um, otherwise that will be very annoying so uh, yep that is just fine like that and then over here, <coughs> uh, excuse me, that was, so this is going to be the plains one. So I once again need to add some water to this. So I need to go like um, this, uh, wait, hang on. Okay, yeah, so it needs to go like these two, like this. Oh, nope, that nearly ended terribly uh, so you just need to pile up like this it's lucky that I have got this much dirt otherwise I would have been stuck down there and there is a zombie and a creeper which is very very bad indeed because I don't want the creeper or the zombie particularly blowing up my stuff um, and then I need to go like this here uh, creeper please don't blow me up Okay, the creeper hasn't blown me up. That's good. That is very, very good. Right, so... Oh, nope. Nope, nope, nope. Nope. Um, and then I need to go, like, along here. And I might be able to just add this in from here. And I think I will have enough and one spare as well. So I can just put that in my pocket. And then I do need more water. No, damn it. Okay. Uh, I'll go and place down this one but then I think I need to 
is does this count as an infinite water source over here um it does that's good so let me just go and quickly refill this here and go and add this and then I need to go and get the ones out of my infantry and one final one so I will have one water bucket spare and then I need to go and get the flowers to go and add in um, just because it's going to be like a plains biome and I have this flower in my infantry anyway so I might as well use that one as well and I won't be able to add all of these and I knew that when I got it uh, when I got the flowers but I don't really want to add those in uh, I'll add two of those I'll add two of these I'll add two of these guys I'll add um, two oxy daisies uh, just across the river like that and then I'll add one orange one and one of these ones here it's just there so and then I'll add another one of these there is this lily of the valley yeah lily of the valley so yeah this is looking quite good if you ask me so now I just need to go and add the cacti over here um, so I just need to really dot them around randomly uh, one in the corner there and one there maybe and then I also happen to have a dead bush that I got with some shears and I'll just place that in the middle and I need some bamboo I need bamboo 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 so I need to go and quickly run over to Laurie's house haven't been in there for a very long time <coughs> sorry about that um, I might need to break down the glass door because I remember when I did go in there I accidentally made all his animals escape and they are still in there um, and where is the bamboo there's only one bit of bamboo but uh, hey um, so if I I just go like that um, and then I'll replace that glass a bit later so if I just leave one block of bamboo left then it, no I wasn't giving it to you greedy panda Gary what was Gary named after no I don't need to follow me but like the, the, someone something happened with someone called Gary and I can't Tribani Tribane? I don't know, I can try Tribiani. Tribiani. Okay, Tribiani. I'm just gonna leave you to it. Um you and Gary can just have a nice day and just sort of stay inside of that. I'll come and replace your door because it sort of ruined it for you. Um But yeah, like I don't there's something that happened with Gary when we were just playing about and I can't remember what it was I think it was a pig and like Laurie accidentally rode him off a cliff or something and that's where the whole Gary thing came from something was called there was a pig and he rode it off a cliff and that became a bit of a thing but I can't remember what that was it might have been a pig actually called Ayo hey, oh, it might be Jarvis that's why it's all the stuff in the left barn is called Jarvis, that's what it's called the barn of the Jarvises I think so I don't know what Gary was, I assume that might have just been the name that he made up um, but yeah so I can hear some zombies underneath my feet so that must mean they're not very happy that this video has been going on um, so yeah I'm going to please the zombies and end the video right here because we have gotten everything done this has been an incredibly productive couple of videos I reckon um, we've got everything done that we needed to and we can now say that the blue greenhouse is fully complete. Um, so yeah, thank you all for watching. Next video will be online next week as always with a link in the description once it is. And I'll see you all later. Goodbye.